Hello YouTube, this is Juan, and this is how I set up my home screen. I did this before, but it wasn't really complete. I didn't have a launcher, no custom icon pack, and I realized, what if I did that? How could I make that setup better? So I did. I tried to make it better, and I hope I succeeded. That'll be for you guys to decide. I'll probably be doing this at least once a month, because I usually change my home screen by then. So then, let's get started. Let's dive straight into the Nova settings and then see what you have to do. The desktop grid should be 8x5 and then the width and height margin should be on none. The persistent search bar should be set to never and then I only have one home screen. Resize all widgets should be checked along with widget overlap and overlap when placing. So should label icons. By the way guys, I'm filming it like this because my camera broke and I'm using my tablet. so. Yeah, that's why it's sort of backwards, so bear with me, please. The drawer is just transparent, and that's really it. The dock I have enabled, and then the width is 7. And then I only show the divider and nothing else. So, the look and feel is, the icon pack is Yoma. It's a paid icon that I really, that I really am glad I paid for. So now, let's get up to setting the widgets. So the dock has 7 icons and 7 icons up and 7 icons wide with the dock. Now the widgets, I'll just remove mine right here and then we'll get started. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna remove the icons because it's really up to you to set up. So, let's get started. The first thing you do is want to add the Google search bar. It should come in default with all Android phones, but sometimes it looks different. If it does, go to Nova settings and click on quick search bar in the look in, in the desktop grid and then in the desktop settings and then you and then go on the jelly bean one then instead of google search go to the very bottom and click on quick search bar so now let's resize there now it's resized and now you see we have a little rectangle for our clock widget to go now this would only work on android 4.2 or higher but a developer made better dash clock widget, which it works on 4.0 and higher, but you do have to pay for it. So some of you guys might want to do this, some of you guys may not. It's your decision. So now you just resize it until it fits into this little square. Into this little rectangle that we've set up for it. So as you can see guys, this home screen is more focused on being minimal, more minimal and less crowded. Now I actually use launcher and an icon pack and make it look beautiful. I enjoy <clears throat> I enjoy this minimalistic setup very much. And on s now we w look forward to some weekly shows like Icon Packs of the week on Saturday, Launchers of the week on Sunday, and then Widgets of the week on Friday. So, goodbye YouTube and thank you for watching.